This game's got so many, so many lovely little things going for it. Also, I'm sorry for my constant mini strokes and failing to fucking talk like a regular human. I can't help it sometimes. Panic in the sky. Panic. Okay. Oh god. I thought we were supposed to say in the shadows, what are the mutant turtles doing with the fucking blimp? Ow. Hell yeah, that was nice. That was not so nice. So that song bangs. There's a really, there's been a really good soundtrack to this game so far. I say I'm sorry and whatnot. Yeah, for all logical purposes, that shouldn't have worked. But we're playing as living reptiles who can talk, as opposed to dead reptiles who can talk. So. Does hit. Enemies in midair. Nice. Sorry, I'm, I'm partially vibing to the background song right now. Him. Eh, may as well get the pizza. Again, better safe than sorry. Better turtle healthy than turtle soup. Alright, come on, whatever you are. Wig nut? If I just focus on him, I should be fine. Ah, there we go. Da 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 da. Fuck yeah.
by the beach. You know, even though there hasn't been a lot of actual voice acting in the cutscenes, I still have to give props to the voice actors for doing pretty well. Coney 2012. Coney 2022. That's it, you better run. Oh no, plungers! Okay, now let's try. Ha! Cool. Like a fury ball. There we go. And do I have a third? No, worth a try. Wait, I can knock the plungers back? Ha! <laughs> Sick. Luckily they don't attack you again after they've caught you once, but still, I don't like it. Rah rah, rescue team, lover of the Russian queen. Oh, he's got a bow and arrow. And he's got a glaive. Fuck that. Also, their glaives keep getting stuck. This might be the most embarrassing version of the Foot Ninjas I've ever come across. But also, they're the best. Thank you. Ow. I like to imagine each time I run up to them, they're just like, Mate, we've got to set up our fucking marriage bell soon. Oh shit, there's a turtle. Quick, run away with the body. I didn't mean to press Y when that was done, I was just spending buttons to break out of the rope. Oh yeah, of course. Step right up, step right up, ring toss! Come on. Uh, aw oh man. I was really hoping one of those would be... Oh, straight up Blackfoot Ninja? They're wearing a lot of colors. I was hoping I would get like some sort of bonus for hitting one of, for killing one of them with their own plungers. Okay, just dash repeatedly over and over under their attack. Do I keep finding bugs? Oh no, oh no. I mean, once you find the river for that, fighting against those ones just becomes very easy. Unless you just... There we go.
and... Oh, so the points don't really matter for much else. You know, out of just because I want to, that last balloon had to die. By the way, I'm not planning on playing through this as every turtle, I'm just going to play as one. I can't move, I think I glitched something. Oh no, there he is. There they are. There we go. That was weird. Anyway, but I do like that I can't fall down those. So it's very hard to gauge when he's going down the sewers. Like, you never know when he's going to pop, uh, pop up next. Damn it. Got him. Oh, there goes his frankness. Also, I, um, I did look up how many levels there are in this thing. There's only 16. Let's follow that torso. So I might be able to do this less plain one sitting. Which is a very easy weekend of editing for me. I gotta focus. Deep breath. Although it depends on how everything else goes, because we've still got half the game to go through. Well, more like the last third of the game, I guess.
Also, I, just, I never noticed before, right? I'll try it on the next foot ninja we get. I'll explain it. So it looks like whenever you do the slide attack to the foot ninja... Damn it, I missed the bug. It looks like you kick them in the balls. Like, it's, it's definitely more of a stomach thing. But it looks like you kick them in the balls. Then again, I can't display on that guy because he's dead. After. See? Like three men in the balls for that. Oh damn it, not that. Anything but that throw. At least these guys don't last long. Oh, I didn't need to do that. You can't cancel that either once you start doing it, which is a bit annoying. All three with that, that's how we do. Do you like that whenever you wiggle yourself free of something attached to your arm, you just fucking high kick it into the air? There we go. I may do a pizzeria, give me the pepperoni, I beg of you. If you're wondering why I'm quoting the voodoo line from the Charles Play slash Tricky movies, it's because I recently uh, watched the Kill Cancer of Cult of Tricky, and I am not a big horror fan, but I've heard so much good shit about Cult. And I'm very recently a Kill Count fan, and I, I don't know why because again, not a big horror dude. explains why this is the let's play you'll likely be seeing in October and not, you know, something a lot scarier like Costume Quest. One, two, three, move. I'm gonna die. There's a couple. Moving on. Nope. Nope. Oh. 
That air special really is a really good uh, tool. Deep breath. I think the turtles themselves are more hip hop fans than metal lads. However, if I were to write for the turtles, I would totally make them just fucking huge Walshy Sleep fans. Hey, another level up. that add like a, a mechanic to it. I saw it happen with his first lot of missiles and I was like, well that's a bit weird, that one didn't go off. So I thought, ah, if he does that attack again I'll try and exploit that. And it worked. I am smart. I do want to put a disclaimer up there. While I did look up any, how many missions there are in this game, that's all I looked up. I have no clue what's actually coming of any of the walkthrough. I didn't even see a walkthrough. I mean, this is just a mission list. So, I figured that shit out on my own. I'm very happy with myself. <laughs> it is Zangius legs and a very tiny head. I'm just imagining like a very tiny Zangief head, like, on his legs. Like, legs go all the way up Griffin, but more terrifying, you know? Dinosaur stampede! Dinosaurs, I love dinosaurs. <laughs> that shouldn't be so hilarious, but it just is. Charge and charge. Back at you, creeps. Deep breath. Oh, very life 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 like exhibits. Oh, no. They're actually coming to life like. They're also very tough, my god. Deep breath. Deep breath. Okay, noted, those guys don't go down easy. Just attacking it to make sure that one doesn't come to life. Damn it! I even double checked! I do wish there were more lines for that. This is gonna get me a major promotion. Go! Back at you, creeps. Deep breath. I'll handle this. Damn it. Deep breath. So, those shields are very good against normal attacks, but not specials. So, uh, keeping that in mind. Shit. 
See, I didn't think I'd activated it, so I thought, oh, oh god, I just noticed they disappear in, like, Mega Man style. I didn't think that barrel activated, so I thought, oh, I'll try and activate it. Turns out it had activated, and then it killed me. to do the dash attack, like through obviously, but then I just somehow went up on the other platform there. How the hell did that happen? Deep breath. Ooh, crystal. So Turtle can't catch his breath here. Deep I'm gonna need some help. Okay, the way that looked for a moment looks like his horn was on fire as he was charging at me, and that was actually kind of cool. I know it was like the other bad guys like firing at me, but it was still pretty dope. Hello, Dask. Now. See, I keep rearing back whenever they, uh, the Triceratons do that pose while I'm attacking them, because it looks like they're about to counter. Into the void. Ah, <sighs> thank you, pizza. All health, all lives. Let's go. You know, yeah. Saraton. No. Looks like another victory for the forces of good. That was definitely the easiest boss fight so far. <laughs> 